It's up there with Haggis, Iron Brew. Oh, thank I can't you. let you do the rest of the interview like that. Thank you, Dim Helen. Mm. <laughs> Now, regular viewers to STV News will know that I get to interview some of the biggest stars in the world. And quite often I'm asked, do I get nervous? The answer is no. That is until today. Well, be afraid. Yeah. Be very afraid. Hey, yes! We are here for the world premiere of the Sex and the City movie. How long have we been waiting for this, ladies and gents? Four hours, four years since the series has been off the air and um, you've been here, you've had four hours. This is Jo here. Jo, you're half Hi. Scottish, aren't you? I'm half Scottish. The yes. better half, I hope. Maybe. So what's so special about Sex in the City? Why have you been queuing for hours? I hate getting old. No, uh, it's I got, good, man. but you can get work done. Seriously? Oh, I had a whole thing It's just thing an inch. Done. Just an inch. That's all, just, just so you look just... Just, I just, I just want to brighten your smile. That's, That's all it. I want to do. Hi, John. Well, I think I'm the luckiest man in Scotland tonight. We have Sienna, Kira, and our mum, Sharma. And you are responsible for all of this. We were just chatting a moment ago. Well, Effectively, in, yes. In part, in part. It wasn't my idea. Brilliant. So, and Kira, how do you get a part in a film written by your mum? Uh, bribery. <laughs> <laughs> I find really works well. Why not? Why not? Well, I've got you talking about bribes earlier on. I've got, I know you like tablets, yes. yeah, so there you go. Oh, and you, have, you, have, you, have you tried tablets? Oh. And some for mum as well. What is it? None for mum. But here, I'll get you one. I'll get you one. I know a man who does know. Live from the red carpet at the Edinburgh International Festival. It's back to you. Thanks, Grant. Okay. Why do you think Kylie has endured for so long? She's modelled herself on me. <laughs> Kelly's nice. So you wouldn't say no then? <laughs> when they kick her out of bed for fun. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't look 40, no she doesn't. No. Why do you think she's still so popular after all these years? Her songs are really, really good and they're really it's catchy. I don't know. Don't I don't know. think I like her. <laughs> so I don't care. Is it the dresses? Because come on, it's a wacky dress. Shoes. But you wouldn't. You just wouldn't honestly wear some of those dresses. Come on. Oh, wow. Yeah, 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 awful. Yeah, but we would. Would you really? <laughs> I would. Oh, you would. Oh, well, there's one there. No. Meryl Streep, knowing me, knowing you. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Clever. Fantastic. Thing. Edinburgh's historic High Street is, of course, home to the Fringe Festival. It covers comedy, theatre, dance, and music across 250 venues in the city. And, of course, let's not forget. Street performers. <laughs> Moving from the fringe to the highbrow. Okay, now, think ballet, think opera, drama, the visual arts, think the International Festival, the home of which is here at the hub at the top of the Royal Mile. Don't tell the other ladies, you're my favourite. You say that to every single one I've of them. I've said it to all three. No, 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 no. Um, now, what is it about sex Scottish in the city? Scottish men, you can't trust them. You, you just can't trust you them. You can trust me, Kim. Right. <laughs>